Hi, in this video, we are going to see about a Python project which is entitled as Kidney Cancer Detection Using Deep Learning Models, which is an IEEE 2023 conference paper. Before seeing the execution of the project, let me brief about this project. So we all know that kidney is one of the important organ for every human being because kidneys acts as a filters that remove unwanted or harmful substances from the body. So kidney is very important for every human being if there is a problem in a kidney it affects the whole body and if there is a kidney cancer or problem in the kidney so the kidney should be made dialysis or transplantation should be made so which is a very cruel so early detection of this kidney cancer will help the patients to get the early diagnosis and get cured. So in this research paper, the authors have proposed the kidney cancer detection using deep learning model and kindly note that we are not going to implement the same as mentioned in the base paper. So now let us see about the, our proposed model. So here we are going to implement two different models and two different kinds of techniques. So we are, go we are going to use unstructured data unstructured data so unstructured data contains about the images so images of the kidney cancer CT scan images so we are going to implement using the algorithm mobile net architecture and we have achieved the training accuracy of 99 percentage and validation accuracy of 99 percentage this is the first model that we are going to use for the unstructured data set and second one using the structured data set which contains about the blood test sample records. So here we are going to use the artificial neural network ANN. So here CKD that is chronic kidney disease data set will be applied and uh, algorithm model is artificial neural network and we have achieved training accuracy of 90% and validation accuracy of 97%. And we are going to implement both the models and we are going to integrate both in a single user interface web framework using flash now let us see about the project abstract so this is the IEEE base paper title kidney cancer detection using deep learning model or you can use our proposed cycle that is AI kidney cancer diagnosis a deep learning approach integrating CT scan and blood test analysis so whichever title you wanted you can use and this is the IEEE base paper abstract and let us see about the our proposed abstract so here we are going to introduce dual approach so dual approach means as i said we are going to uh, implement using the images and also using the data set records so we will be implementing both and uh, one model is using mobile net architecture and another one using artificial neural network and uh, those uh, data uh, accuracy values have been mentioned here and coming to the first that is ct scan image data set contains about 5000 77 normal images and it contains 2283 tumor class images so these are the total images that contain so now let me show you about the data set images of the ct scan image so in the model folder you can find the both the folder structured model and unstructured model so images contain about unstructured model so in that you can see the data set which contains strain and uh, validation fully in the train you will be having normal and tumor so you can see normal about 4061 images in this so you can see the CT scan images so these are all the images that you are going to train up the system and in the tumor part you can see about it is 100 and 1826 images in the tumor part so you can see these are all the images that we are going to train up the system and uh, in the test folder we the validation folder we have the same with the normal the tumor here it contains 1016 images of uh, normal case and uh, tumor is about 450 57 tumor case images here for the test folder validation folder so this is about the data set of the 
unstructured model so coming to the structured model you can see this is the CKD data set so there are around uh, 400 data set records which contains the attributes like ID, age, BP, SGA, LSU, or BC, PC, PCC, BA, BGR, CBU, CCC, OD kinds of things let me show you explain about those things in execution and these are this is about the data set part so in uh, so here I said that the, in the data set part of the structured data we conduct about 26 attributes and 400 individual data set records of these things. So now uh, th these both are integrated in the web interface also that is also mentioned in the abstract. But so coming to the existing system, so existing system was developed using a CNN model. So those details are being given here and the disadvantage of the existing system is being mentioned here and proposed system contains about the, our model which has a mobile net and CNN and the data set part everything whatever we discuss is being given here and this is about the advantage of the proposed system and here you can just see the system architecture so as mentioned we have two data set CKD data set and image data set so CKD data set is given for the training purpose of your model artificial neural network and image data set with mobile net architecture so the predicted result uh, using both will be normal or cancer and the performance analysis will be shown at the end so here you can see the system requirements with the hardware and software requirements as mentioned we have developed the project using python the version that we have used is python 3.10.9 and web framework flask and front end part is html CSS, and javascript this is the IWB base paper reference so before execution make sure that you have fulfilled the requirements that is mentioned in the requirements file with the exact version of the python and the library is installed in your system so now let us see the execution of the project so just copy the source code location go to your command prompt first go to the drive location where you have pasted the code in my case i have pasted my code in f drive so let me go to the f drive so now type cd space and paste the location that we are copied and click enter so now we are into the source code location now type python app.py and click enter so now kindly wait for a few seconds or few minutes so now you can see this url just copy this url go to any of your browser i'm going to google chrome and paste the url that we are copied So now you can see the home screen and welcome to the project with the project title kidney cancer detection using deep learning model. So just click this login menu, so just will be navigated to the login page and kindly note that this is a static login page because we have not used any database in the project. So just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and then click the login button. So now it will be showing the login success message and click OK. So now it will be navigated to the upload part. So this first part is using the structured data so here you need to upload the data set so here you need do not upload the image if you are uploading image here it will throw error here so first upload the csv data set so this part is the structured data after that only we will be showing the unstructured data so first let me just choose the file and go to the uh, source code location so here in the test day so sorry in the source code you can find the upload.csv just select this so I'm selecting the upload.csv file and then click the upload button. So now after uh, the data set has been uploaded, it will be navigated to the preview part where you can preview the data set that we have uploaded and you can just scroll down till the end of the page and you can find the complete data set has been loaded into the preview. Now let's click this click to train or test button. Now after few seconds you can see the training finish message and click OK. So now it will be navigated to the prediction part. So this is the prediction of the uh, structured data part. So let me show you with a few cases. So as mentioned in the, uh, the data set part there are various uh, features available. So let me show you with the case with the uh, first case with the age of uh, 48 blood sugar sorry blood pressure with 80 albium with 1, sugar with 0, red blood cells with normal, PUSL is normal, PUSL clumps is uh, not present, bacteria, 
not present blood glucose random is 121 and blood urea is 36 serum keratin is 1.2 potassium is 4.627 244 white blood cell count is 7800 hypertension s diabetes mellitus yes coronary artery disease no pedal edema no and anemia no so now let me check the written result for this case that I have entered and click the predict button and now you can see the prediction result is abnormal which means that the case is a kidney cancer problem and now let me check with the other case which has the age of 58 blood pressure of 80 albin of 0 sugar with 0 RBC is normal and blood cells PU cell is normal and PU cell clumps is not present bacteria are not present blood glucose random is 131 blood urea is 18 serum keratin is 1.1 potassium with 3.5 white blood cell count is 6800 hypertension no diabetes mellitus no coronary artery disease no pedal edema no anemia no so now let me check with this case and click the predict button now you can see the predicted result is normal so this is being predicted using the ann model because this is a structure data so that is being predicted using the model e an artificial neural network so in this way you can check with the other cases that is provided in the test data or the data set that we have trained up with there are more data set records so i cannot show you which each and every one it takes more time the length of the video will be more so you can check with other cases now let me move to the next part using the perform that is the performance analysis of this uh, algorithm so here you can see the performance analysis of this uh, structure data using ann which contains precision recall and f uh, f measure value so here you can see the precision f f1 and pre f1 value for the normal and abnormal case and here you can see the confusion matrix with the true and predicted label of the both the cases and uh, so till now we have seen about the ann model that is uh, the structure data now let me go to the next part that is the using the unstructured data using the image CT scan image so let me click this image preview so once if you click this image preview it will be navigated to this upload part where you need to upload the image so here you need to upload the image here you need not to upload the CSV file so here uh, in the ten source code folder say test data you can find the uh, structure and unstructured data so where in unstructured data you can find the normal and tumor images so now let me select an image this is the image I've selected and then click the submit button so now you can see the predicted result is normal so now we are uh, checking about the unstructured data so this is developed using mobile net architecture so mobile net architecture predicted result as normal so in case if you wanted to check with the other image just click this preview menu again so now let me go to the tumor part and let me select an image so this is the image i have selected and click submit and now you can see the predicted result is tumor let me click the preview part again so now let me click another image so this is the image that is available in the tumor case and click submit and now you can see the predicted result is tumor let me click the preview part again and let me go to the choose file let me select the normal part here in the normal let me select this image and then click submit 
and now you can see the pictured result is normal so in this way you can check with the other images that is available in the test and the train data also so now let me go to the source code folder model and structured image so now we need to go to the uh, train folder and let me select an image randomly there are many images available let me select this image and then click the submit and now you can see the pictured result is tumor so in this way you can check with the other images also so if i'm going to check with all the images it takes more time the length of the video will be high so now let me move to the next part that is the performance analysis part so this is the performance analysis part for the unstructured data that is using the mobile net architecture so here you can see the performance analysis parameter like accuracy precision and recall and f measure value so accuracy is 0.0, .0 sorry 0 0.996 precision value 0 0.991 recall value 0 0.996 f measure 0 0.996 so this is the uh, performance analysis parameter and here you can see the confusion matrix of so the proven printer label of the both the case of normal and tumor this is a confusion matrix of it and final comes the chart part and kindly note that this chart is a static chart this is not a dynamic chart because as i said earlier we're not using any database in the projects to store the value so this is being depicted from the backend code the model code that we have developed so here chart contains two charts that is model loss graph and the model accuracy graph so here you can see the model loss graph with the loss and epoch that we have developed the model and model accuracy graph contains of versus accuracy versus apex that we have developed for the model so this is about the charts which contains model loss and model accuracy graph and let me log out from this part and this is all about the project kidney cancer detection using deep learning models and thank you for watching